Hello, Greg from Balloon Market here and welcome to BMTV. Now, it's a bit of a special one this week. We have, we have somebody from a, a faraway country. In fact, I don't even know what country you're in. You're in Italy at the moment? I, I, I've not get, no, let me, let me, let me introduce you. It's Alberto Falcone, everybody. It's been a long time since I've seen you, but hello and welcome to uh, BMTV for the first time, I think, in, in four years. Yeah, it's true. Thank you very much to invite me to have this, uh, this uh, interview or this moment together. No, no, we're, we're really happy that you, you, you've been able to do it. So which country are you in at the moment? In this moment, uh, I'm uh, in Spain, in, Spain. in Barcelona. Okay. Barcelona, exactly. But uh, of course, I come from Italy. I'm Italian. Mm -hmm. And for a few years, I lived uh, in uh, Budapest. So my, my, it's very difficult sometimes for the people to understand where exactly I am. Yeah. I'm all the time moving. And then when before COVID, I guess you were just traveling all over the world, weren't you? Yeah, before COVID, because COVID stop everything yeah yeah so uh, thank you again for for being on but obviously a lot of our viewers might not know who you are because you've not been on uh, on a regular basis so for those of you that don't know who you are um do you want to tell everybody a little bit just about you and your journey and how you got to be to where you are now yeah of course uh, my name is alberto alberto falcone i come from italy i already told you and uh, I, I'm doing this job uh, as a, a teacher or so as instructor for more than 20 years. So I'm very old. <laughs> it's okay. You still look young. <laughs> and, you uh, look young. <laughs> <laughs> thank you very much. And uh, uh, yeah, during this period, I travel, uh, I travel uh, around the world, uh, about 40 different countries where I, I taught, wow. I, I, I Taught, uh, and uh, I met uh, people, uh, professional people in balloon industry every time, and uh, it was uh, all the time a very good experience. Yeah. Uh, during this period, uh, I developed some techniques. So uh, normally I teach my um, my own techniques, but uh, sometimes uh, I also make fundamentals uh, and uh, all the things that are really important to grow up in the in the industry. Yeah, yeah, that's fantastic. So how did you get into the industry? What did you, what brought you into the industry? Uh, that's very, very, um, because uh, when I was living in Italy, um, I, I, I had a, a shop, uh, it was a gadget shop. Okay. Uh, so we we were we were selling many different items like uh, uh, small puppets, uh, this is like this. Yeah. And uh, I, we met someone that offered to us to sell also balloons. And I was very curious to, to, to see what I can do with balloons. And I, I went to a, a seminar that was organized by Balloon Express in Italy, but the old Balloon Express. Yeah. I, I, I'm yeah. speaking, it's already almost 30 years ago. And uh, from this moment, I really, I. I felt in love with the elasticity and with the color of balloon. And I started to, to manage the balloon in this way. For the first two years, it was just a little bit more than hobby. Mm -hmm. And then I started to make it as a professional. And my life changed totally. totally. Yeah, yeah. I normally used to say that I had a life before balloon and a life after balloon. Yeah. So, and you obviously enjoy the life because here you are 20 years later doing, doing, still doing it. Yeah, absolutely. Change not just, it's true when I say that to change my life because uh, uh, from this moment uh, I, I, I start to recognize in myself creativity and uh, you know, artistic side that until that moment was a little bit high. Yeah. I, 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 me too. I was not able to recognize because balloons uh, start. I started to to see the life in a different way, and uh, because also I had uh, the the opportunity to compete uh, in a balloon industry and mm -hmm. something like this. I, I, I really changed uh, totally my life. I started to travel the other world. My my friend. Uh, right now are no more closer friend uh, in my city but uh, are really all over the world yeah so yeah. it's 
something that uh, I don't know. If I if I look back or watch back on my on my past, is incredible. Is incredible. I couldn't uh, imagine something like this. Yeah, yeah. And that's that's the balloon industry that has done that. So um, that's that's absolutely amazing. And and I think the last time we met, like I say, I think it was around four years ago. But I think the thing that struck me the most was this creativity that you you mentioned because you don't, you're not just creative with balloons, are you? You're creative. You're an artist. You you've written books. You've done all sorts of different things. Yeah, the balloon just opened a door, and then from this door. Any, any, any way that I can use to express myself, uh, my idea, my, my art, uh, I, I use. So uh, I, I used to, to, to draw a lot, for mm -hmm. example. I like very much to draw and uh, I use also to write. I wrote a book uh, and uh, I, I, I used to modeling with the, with the plastiline. I don't know in English. Yeah, plasticine, oh. yeah. Plasticine, yeah. yeah. So yeah. I have done also some some sculpture in this uh, in this amazing in amazing. this direction, yeah. So yeah, it, just uh, the balloon, uh, it was the key, yeah. was the key to open yeah. a, a door that was inside of me. Yeah. And I think this is this is a very good message to say to the people that through something like this, like balloons, even for the people that are starting and maybe are a little bit scary about techniques, about all these things. Mm -hmm. Through the balloon, you can discover yourself. Absolutely. is is one of the, 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 the most beautiful uh, paths that you can do yeah. in yourself by using uh, something like balloons in yeah. my case. It is amazing, isn't it? Because some of your work that I've seen and many, many other people, they what you can create with balloons it's just amazing because people, if you don't, if you're not in the industry, you just see a bunch of balloons. But when you're in the industry, what you see that can be created, and particularly since the organic craze came, however many years ago, it just blows my mind what people can do and what people can charge for it as well. You can you can charge a huge yeah. amount of money for for of pieces oh. of rubber that are inflated with air, <laughs> and it's it's amazing. <laughs> It's yeah. true. It's true. And you mentioned something really important, something that when I started, for example, I didn't understood immediately. For this, uh, I say that for the two more first years, it was like a hobby because I didn't understood immediately the business part of mm. the balloon. Uh, but it's really important. It's, it's something that must to go together, balance, balance together the creativity and yeah. the business so the people can really enjoy their life, pay their bill, and uh, also be creative and be, and be something unique in the world and yeah. change uh, the, the, the reality for them. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, you're absolutely right. I think a lot of people that do get into this industry do it because they enjoy the creativity. But as you say, the business side, if you want to make a business of it, you might, you might just do it because you yeah. enjoy it. Um, but if you want to make a business of it that, that pays its way, then you need to focus on, on that business side. We could, we could talk for hours about that, I'm sure. But, yeah, uh, that's true. That's, but anyway, you absolutely anyway right. you're going to show us how to make something that is very funky, yeah. very, very funky. And I really like this. So what, Alberto, tell everybody, what are you, what are you going to show us? I will show you a way to do a very popular animal right now. It's an insect, it's a bee. Yeah. And uh, right now you, you can find it uh, any, anywhere around you because uh, they, they, it's like uh, it, it was the, the unicorn, I don't know, a few years ago. Uh, you know, the, the people try to use uh, the bee anywhere for advertising, for yeah. party. You know, even in, a, in the catalog of balloon, you can find the new bee, uh, new bee design. And uh, I was thinking to show you a way, quite easy and uh, uh, fast to do, to make a bee good good size. Okay. You can do the size you want at the end. I will show you a size like this. Okay. I don't know, in, in, in inch, I don't know, in centimeter, is probably around 60. Yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. So that's about okay. 24 inches. There you go. Yeah, probably, yeah, Thereabouts. around 24 inches. Okay. Okay. If, uh, if I, if you want, I can start. Yes, please. Perfect. 
I'm really ready. What uh, I will use are five inch, five inch in different colors. And uh, the first uh, I use uh, are five inch onyx black. Mm -hmm. Okay, and unfortunately my, my t-shirt is black as well. But uh, I inflate six of them uh, to three inch. So that's just one pump. I have to tie them together as doublets mm -hmm. in this way, as tight as possible. This is really important in this, uh, in this case. So the balloon must to be very, very tight. Okay. At the end, uh, you will have uh, like a, a six balloon cluster. I already prepped, so I can mm, take more, 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 less time to explain yeah, it. Yeah. But uh, it's uh, a six balloon cluster. Uh, all the balloons are inflated exactly the same size, are three inch. Uh, I remember you. And then uh, I need uh, uh, again to make a six balloon cluster by using a different color this time, colors this time, and uh, I, I use uh, exactly three pink, mm -hmm. five inch pink, two five inch uh, uh, white, mm -hmm. this time my t-shirt is fine, <laughs> and one red, okay. okay? But the concept is exactly the same. So you have to make uh, uh, three doublets. Exactly the same size again, so it's a three inch. It's a really not important uh, as you uh, make the the, 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 the duplets. Mm -hmm. uh, you can uh, you can uh, mix the color without any problem okay. because you can change the position of color later when you put them together in the cluster. And then I twist them together uh, all the time in the center. And the right position of them is exactly this. So we have one, two, three pink, yep. one red in the middle, and two white over. So if you can, if you look in this way, exactly in this way, you already obtain like a face. Okay. Yeah. It will be the face of the V. I see. And I can uh, join together with the, the head, the, 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 the back part of the, the, the head, that uh, it was uh, the, the six balloon cluster black. Yeah. And uh, I tie them together as tight as possible by using one of the, 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 the neck that I have in the middle. So I have to pull them as tight as possible together. This, uh, this uh, figure that mm -hmm. I, I have done right now, call it topiary. Okay. No, yeah. It okay. uh, are 12 balloons, same size, that, uh, that uh, make like a sphere shape. Yeah, yeah. But one side is the face and the other side is the, the I don't know how you call it, nuca in Italiano, but I don't know, the, the, the head. The back of your head, yeah. Back okay. of the head. Yeah. I guess. Okay, back of back of the head is okay. No? Oh, then uh, we we will come back uh, with the head uh, to finish it. Uh, but I want to show you how to do the body right now. All right. Is uh, uh, is is uh, basically the same. I just change the the color another time because uh, I will need to use six uh, yellow mm -hmm. and six uh, onyx black. Yeah. So Alberto, you were just using the pump to measure them. Do you ever use a balloon yeah, size? Yeah, I'm using the pump, uh, so I, 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 I don't do noise. That uh, probably is better for the... For, for, for so the, no, normally the you would, you'd use the electric inflator? Uh, yeah, I, I have an uh, electric inflator, or I have also the, 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 the sizer, yeah, you know, yeah. the electrical yeah. sizer, so I can inflate two by two yeah. in the same yeah. moment at the same size. Yeah. I have both of yeah. them, but for, for uh, uh, also pr practicity, and uh, uh, I think uh, with the hand pump uh, in front of the camera become better. I can explain myself better. I don't have this problem of the noise. Yeah. No, it works well though. Uh, but uh, uh, if you count the number of pump, uh, if you use this kind of pump, of mm -hmm. course, because 
on the market there are many kinds of pump. The Qualitex pump and uh, ENS, ENS pump, uh, it's, uh, uh, it's very easy because one pump like this, uh, it means uh, three inch. Yeah. Two pumps, uh, it means in this way, one, two are four inch about, very close. Yeah. And then three, three pumps are four and a half inch. Yeah. Yeah. So quite easy also to have uh, uh, every time the same the same size. Yeah. And in this case, uh, I inflate them with uh, three pumps. It means four and a half inch. One, two, three. Okay. And uh, I have to do uh, a six balloon cluster with um, five yellow and one black. Black one, and I twist them together another time. I will use them uh, in this way. Yeah. Okay, with the with, uh, one open. Ah, uh, I, I'm really sorry, Greg. I have done a mistake. Oh. I, I confuse a little bit, but uh, it's not a problem because uh, I can also show to, especially to the beginner, how to change one of the balloons. Okay. Because this balloon uh, is not uh, the five inch that I have to use, but uh, I should use uh, a six inch uh, quick link on its black as well. I see. So okay. I just change it with the uh, with the. You know the B the the the, the B as the the. Steam. Yeah. Okay, so this is this is the, the is inflated exactly the same size. Uh -huh. Just uh, squeeze it a little bit like this to have a, a longer shape, and then uh, I can tie now uh, to the to the center of this uh, cluster. I do like it when so mistakes happen the, because the when the steam of the, the, the bee. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, that's good. I like it when mistakes Sorry, happen, Alberto, because this, this. it just shows how to fix them. Um, and mistakes happen, so it's 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 real life. This is this is life, so sometimes happens. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and uh, yeah. It, it, but it's really easy to to to, to change. It absolutely. In this case. Yeah. The second uh, the second part of this uh, uh, topiary is uh, is. Uh, Exactly opposite. So I will use five orange black and one yellow. Uh, there are even other color you can use uh, to to make a B. Uh, for example, the golden road. Uh, it's very it's very fine instead the the, the, the the yellow. Or if you want, uh, even you can do in uh, in orange. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, this time uh, I have to use a uh, uh, five inch, so this time it's correct. And uh, I'll twist them together. Another time, this is the position to use them. Yeah. So I have like a flower, five, five petal flower with the uh, yellow in the middle. Perfect. And I can tie them together as tight as possible another time, so you, you can uh, you can marriage the the two clusters in this way. Yeah. And then by using a better use like two. Okay. Um, two two necks. Yeah. Together, because you can make a, you can pull stronger. Yeah. So I use two necks together, and uh, I I use them exactly to fix the second part of this topiary. Another time, as tight as possible. So this is uh, exactly the body, okay. body and head is exactly done in the same way, yeah. just changing color yeah. and changing shine. Yeah. Uh, sorry, changing uh, size, size. Sorry, my English sometimes. Oh, 
and now I can tie together the two parts of the, the, the B. Mm -hmm. I use a, a neck that I have here, maybe, I don't know if you can see. Yep. This is the neck I'm, I'm, I take from the middle, and I can use it to tie together the head and the body. As tight as possible, another time. So just uh, wrap the neck around, and I can find right now the position yeah. of okay. the head. Oh, the position is easy to find because here I have the yellow one that was in the middle of this cluster. So it's, it makes the base for the chin mm -hmm. of the of the bee. You can see. Yeah. And this is the, correct because on the top here you have also this uh, this uh, um, this three inch inflated that is exactly in the middle of the the the, the I don't know the shoulder. Huh? <laughs> of the bee. Yeah. So it, it, it is very, very, very uh, stable uh, without big problem. And now I can finish. Uh, we need uh, to make uh, uh, a couple of other um, details. Uh, the most important, maybe the most important, uh, it's uh, to make uh, the, the eyebrows. Okay. Just to I hope because this the color I cannot see very well the color sorry I need a black one yeah oh this is a 260 Q yeah you have to inflate it uh, this length is okay it's not a really f a, a, a specific length but what is it is more important is to have a long and inflated part of the 260 okay I hope you can see yep. before to close it. Okay. So I have done this bubble. I have deflated the bubble. So uh, I have a long uh, uninflated yep. balloon Got here. It. And then uh, I need to make uh, a sequence of bubble and pinch twist. In this way, the first bubble must to go around the eye yeah. of the bee. In this way. And exactly here, I make uh, a pinch twist. Mm -hmm. Okay, I try to to work on the white, sorry, because my t-shirt. That's good. And then I need a second, another bubble, the the same line like the first one, and the rest uh, I can just deflate the the, the the the. Sorry, I can just deflate. Deflate it, yeah, yeah. yeah. And the fighter thing. Sorry, sometimes. And uh, you know, I have uh, this, this, uh, this uh, exactly this sequence. Perfect. Yes, very nice. Now I start from the middle of the eye. I I have to take one of the one of the the, the, the uh, neck of yep. the five inch I have uh, here, and I fix I I tie the pinch twist in the middle of the eye. Okay. Yeah. And then these two parts that are quite long, I can use easily to uh, wrap them around, passing from the, from here under the eye. Okay, I pull and I tie. Okay. And I tie it, wrapping around. And the same I will do with the second, the other side of the of the 260 under the eye in this way and then pull and uh, wrap around okay, so I, I i have done this uh, okay, the eyebrow that's cool love it the, that's really clever yeah, are important the eyebrow because uh, give the the, the 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 focal point of the eye yeah uh, yeah that's brilliant and then again, uh, I will finish very very fast uh, by doing uh, uh, do two wings. Okay. Uh, just uh, a two to sixty Q uh, pale blue are okay. If you want, you can use also the diamond clear or the, the another kind of blue. is is up to you. Absolutely. Yeah. I inflate them with five pumps if I use this kind of pump. Yeah. Or anyway, 
you have to leave like uh, approximately 15 centimeter uninflated. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Huh? And you just uh, tie it as a big loop. Perfect. Then a little, a little uh, uh, changing a little bit the the the, 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 the shape in this way. Yeah. So I just have a, a longer shape. I do the same with the second one. So I tie the neck and the and the tip together and the the final together and then I have to make this with my hands just to, just to modify a little bit the shape so I can tie them together in this way mm -hmm. by leaving a little gap in between. Yeah. Uh, this gap is quite important. I can cut the rest of these uh, two to sixties and uh, I can pass between the head and the body. Uh, under the, 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 the bee, pass between them, and uh, I can put them exactly like, like uh, here in this position. That's so simple. Very simple, yeah, very yeah. simple. Not, not complicated. So you, you have, uh, you have the, 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 the position is exactly where the head touch the body. Yeah. Where the yeah. three inch touch the two, uh, four and a half inch. Yeah. Yeah. Again, uh, another small detail you can do by using a 260 Q yellow mm -hmm. or another color as you prefer. And uh, you have just to puff a little bit of air inside and pull in this way until the moment that uh, you will develop like a bubble. Okay. Uh, a small bubble on the top of this uh, 260. Yeah. Exactly there. Okay. And uh, here I, I, I pinch this and I uh, make a note and I tie it. Okay, so the small bubble is exactly on the top. Yeah. I puff again a little bit of air. I decide how long, how long, sorry, I want to have the antennas. Yeah. So yeah. here, for example, and uh, I do another note, I tie again. And I have to repeat the same. So puff up a little bit of air inside. And uh, here I will do my note. And at the end, I need another another uh, small bubble like the first the very first one i have done yeah there you go a little there bit smaller in this way in this case like this and i tie again so there is, is a sequence of uh, uh these uh, two bubbles the first and the second and the, the, the first and the last and in the middle we have uh, puff balloons yeah and again yeah. I can put it by passing through the head uh, under under the, the chin in this way and uh, until half the head. Okay, I yeah. hope you can yeah. see. Fantastic. So I have the two small antennas. Yeah, that's great. Okay, last the really really last uh, last detail. Uh, by using uh, four 350Q onyx black. In this way, puff a little bit of air inside and tie them together. One note, tying them together yep. in this yep. way. And uh, you have uh, the, the, the legs of the, of the, uh, of the bee, okay? Yeah. Two, two yeah. pair of legs. And uh, you can put them through the body, this time opposite. So from the from the the, 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 the high of the body to the bottom, yeah. here and here. 
Okay, so you have also this, uh, this very funny effect. Yeah, that's great. The, yeah, I love it. Just uh, uh, draw the eyes by using a marker. This is a, this is a Sharpie, uh -huh. the, the black Sharpie. You can also use other kind of, uh, of uh, markers if you want. And that's it. Alberto, I love that. I absolutely love that. Okay. I hope I hope uh, you you can use it. Be careful the steam because uh, it's very pointed. <laughs> I love it because that all the individual parts of that were were easy. They looked easy. Maybe you just made them look easy. But you have clusters, you have 5 inch, you have uh, quick links. It's not, it's not too complicated because uh, we have not uh, a really uh, distortion to do yeah. or uh, something yeah. that, is, uh, that for beginners especially make the things very difficult when you have to distort maybe apple distortion or something like this. Uh, in this case it's just to inflate uh, and uh, uh, be, be quiet uh, um, focused in the size that uh, you, yeah. you, you inflate yeah. the balloon. But that's the other amazing thing. All you used was a Qualitex hand pump. That's that's all you used, and you were able to create that. In this case, yes. Yeah. Yeah. If I, if I if I use a a, a machine, it's easy, is faster. Yeah. Quick, yeah. Quick. yeah. But but so simple for somebody starting out. So because when you look at that, you don't realize how it's made. But when you show us how it's made, it's 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 magical. It's magical. Absolutely amazing. <laughs> well, Alberto, as I've got an itchy nose. As a guest on BMTV, you, you get to ask everybody a question. So the question of the week. So I know I'm surprising you with this because I forgot to warn you and I forget to yeah. warn everybody. But do you have a question you would like to ask everybody watching? And they'll leave comments down below. Uh, oh, I, I, I think... Um I think it's not really a question. I would like really to know how the people, how the people are uh, uh, use some words to describe how how amazing it is to be in this industry. Ooh. Why not? Just some words, maybe two, three words. Explain to the other people how amazing it is to be part of the industry, it is to be part of this community that uh, it's uh, uh, really creative, I told uh, uh, also before, and really amazing, uh, amazing and uh, worldwide community. I love that, love that question. This is my request. Alberto, I absolutely love it. So what, what few words would you use to describe being in the balloon industry? Fantastic, <laughs> fantastic. Alberto, Thank you so much for doing this. I really appreciate it. And I love, absolutely love that design. So, so thank you very, very much. And thank you, everybody out there for watching. Thank you for subscribing. If you've not subscribed, please do hit the subscribe button, hit the little bell icon, and you'll be notified every time we upload a new video. Stay safe, stay happy, and I'll see you next week. Bye. Ciao, Greg. Thank you very much.